Bosch, a global leader in engineering and technology, has made a pivotal decision that could reshape the landscape of hydrogen innovation. The company is ending its development of solid oxide fuel cells and redirecting its focus towards green hydrogen production technologies. This strategic shift marks a significant turning point in the pursuit of sustainable energy solutions. Bosch's decision reflects slow market adoption of SOFCs, which may be due to the practicality of green hydrogen via PEM electrolysis, which operates at 50 to 80 degrees Celsius compared to SOFCs 800 to 1000 degrees Celsius. Its lower temperature and scalability make PEM technology more viable. The company will channel its resources into proton exchange membrane electrolysis components, aiming to bring these to market this year. This supports Bosch's vision of hydrogen as a multi-billion euro market by 2030. The pivot towards hydrogen production reflects both current market realities and the increasing importance of hydrogen in the global energy transition. Bosch has identified growing demand for green hydrogen, particularly in industrial applications and heavy transport. Hydrogen, as a versatile energy carrier, has attracted substantial investment worldwide as industries strive to meet stringent climate targets. By focusing on PEM electrolysis, Bosch positions itself at the heart of this burgeoning market. PEM electrolysis is a key technology for producing green hydrogen, using renewable electricity to split water into hydrogen and oxygen. This method offers greater flexibility and scalability compared to technologies requiring extensive infrastructure changes, making it an attractive option for integration with renewable energy systems. Bosch's ambitious plans to generate billions in revenue from hydrogen technologies by 2030 align with global trends. Many nations, including the United States, China and European Union members, have announced significant investments to accelerate hydrogen adoption. However, Bosch has expressed concerns about the slow pace of prioritizing hydrogen energy in Europe, viewing it as a potential obstacle to achieving the technology's full potential. A crucial aspect of Bosch's announcement is the termination of its partnership with British company Ceres Power. Bosch will end its involvement in Ceres Power's solid oxide fuel cell technology and treat its 17.44% stake in the company as a non-core financial investment. This decision underscores Bosch's shift away from fuel cell electricity conversion, which the company now views as commercially unviable in the near term due to limited demand and engineering challenges. Notably, Bosch has criticized the lack of policy-driven prioritization for hydrogen to electricity conversion in Europe, particularly in Germany. The company's CEO, Stefan Hartung, stated that the conversion of hydrogen into electricity is not receiving the necessary priority in Europe. This critique highlights a broad attention within Europe's energy transition strategy, where hydrogen production has received significant investment but utilization technologies like solid oxide fuel cells have lagged in prioritization. Bosch's strategic realignment demonstrates a pragmatic approach to the evolving energy landscape. By focusing on PEM electrolysis and hydrogen production, the company positions itself to capitalize on the growing demand for green hydrogen. This decision not only reflects Bosch's growth ambitions, but also signals a call for greater urgency in aligning policy frameworks with the needs of industry innovators. As we look towards 2030 and beyond, Bosch's commitment to building a robust hydrogen economy highlights the critical role this technology will play in global decarbonization efforts. Thanks for watching Hydrogen Fuel News. Share your thoughts on Bosch's big change in the comments and don't forget to subscribe for more updates. See you next time.